this is farm with fred welcome to my youtube channel subscribe leave a comment and share in farming uh there are several things that a farmer needs in order to succeed and among them is uh, a fertile soil i know with technology things have changed uh advancement of technology and uh Farmers, majority of the farmers no longer need the soil because uh, we have the soilless farming. We, are, we, are, we also have uh, uh, in soilless farming where we are using the cocoa peat. The, uh, we are also using a uh, water-based solution to, to grow our crops. But for the soil-based uh, farmers, uh, fertility or soil fertility is key. And like I've I told you in uh, uh, in our previous episodes, in order to know your soil fertility, you have to analyze your soil. You have to do a soil test and get to know uh, uh, the fertility of your soil. But uh, after analysis, there are different recommendations uh, that a farmer is usually given. Among them is use of manure. Uh, most of the most of the farming lands have been degraded. They have lost their fertility. They have lost the the so-called the the the, the, the biology uh, inside the soil because everything has been has been killed. And what has killed these uh, living microorganisms in the soil that used to improve the soil fertility of our soil is one excessive use of synthetic products. Now. In order now to restore back uh, this good soil or to restore back the soil to the to the good nature they used to be before, there are some things a farmer should do. And these things are recommended by when you take your soil to the lab, when it is analyzed, uh, you advise on what to do. And among them is applying manure. As you can see, this soil manure has already been applied. This manure. Manure, manure, manure is an organic uh, product. is 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 organic uh, product that improves uh, the, the 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 soil nature or improves the soil structure because uh, in the soil there is a relationship uh, uh, that there is a uh, uh, a relationship in the soil between. Uh, the biology or the microorganisms inside the soil, the soil itself, and the plant that is growing in the uh, above the soil. Because our main aim is to grow a healthy plant and a productive plant. So if you lack, if you have the soil alone, the soil will help you to anchor. It acts as anchorage. Then inside the soil, we have the microorganism that does their activities inside the soil and produces now the the organic materials and the nutrient and the fungus that are in, that are, that are needed by the plant so in order to restore these things we have to make sure we feed the biology or we feed the microorganisms through the soil and you cannot feed them by use of a synthetic product in different plants needs uh, uh, needs the same same nutrient, the same same phosphorus that is needed by uh, tomatoes is the same same phosphorus that is needed by bananas is the same same phosphorus that will be needed by cabbage. So we have to to reform and to do uh, and to reverse our soil to the to the previous use. Some farmers, like you can see, the land is well plowed, manure has already uh, been applied, but. Uh, it's not a must to do this because among some farmers are also uh, observing something known as a zero tillage or zero uh, cultivation of the farm uh, in order now to improve their soil structure and make sure there is a, a good biology uh, or microbiology uh, inside the soil. So as you can see on this uh, on this other side. The farm is left bushy, nothing is done in this farm, in this section. Uh, this is as a, as a method of trying to recover or trying to improve 
the nature of the soil not necessarily uh, the, 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 the land is weedy but it's trying to regenerate and make the soil productive because if this uh, farm stays in, in this manner then you come there are some uh, uh, some farmers tend uh, tend to use uh, the weed killers in order to kill the weed now that those, that is for the zero tillage the farmers who, are, who do not want to to do the plowing using a tractor or using a jembe they will use the weed to control a weed killer to control this some are very organic they don't want to use any chemical to weed so they'll come with a nylon cover cover all the section and make sure they kill the the weed then you replant because once this weed dies uh, it acts as green manure it acts as, as manure to the soil so you'll make sure you you'll, you'll uh, find that each and every time the soil is healthy and like i told you our main uh, objective or the key thing in farming Make sure you have a healthy soil in order to have as good production as possible. If it were not for the good soil fertility uh, in this capsicum, they could not have uh, leached at this point because, like I've always been telling you, different stages need different uh, uh, nutrient, and in order to achieve that, you have to make sure you know your soil and. You do the necessary. And one thing I've learned uh, with organic farmers, uh, the, the farmers that are growing organically, these farmers make sure their soil in, uh, in, the, in where they are, they, they are growing their crops, the nutrient in that soil is enough to, to carry the crop up to maturity. They do, not like uh, uh, the, the synthetic farmers, the farmers who are using a synthetic product where they wait uh, at this stage to apply these, at that stage to apply that. No, 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 no. For the for the organic green farmers, they make sure by the time they are starting, they are very sure that by, uh, the, 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 their soil is very secure or it's very healthy for, for the crop to, to, to develop. And on the process of growing the crop, the only thing they do is just few foliars here and there. And just like animals or human beings, a healthy soil makes a healthy crop. And a healthy crop is very tolerant or sometimes resistant to some pests and diseases. Mostly to diseases. Because pests may attack from all different angles. But to diseases, you, some, uh, when the, 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 the plant is healthy, it becomes hardy. It becomes hardy and strong in order to resist to uh, the environment because uh, uh, most of the diseases that attack crops are environment related uh, uh, diseases. So, uh, if you take care of your soil, you make sure uh, the soil is well fertile, you may end up cutting the cost of uh, the, the product that you use to control uh, uh, pests and, uh, and diseases. Until next time, subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can continue learning together.